Hi, my name is Sherry Berger and I'm a server at Floyd Memorial Hospital. I'm John Hodge, I'm the Facilities Manager here at Floyd Memorial Hospital and Health Services in New Albany, Indiana. Well, I serve a steam table and I'm a cashier, do a little bit of everything. And one of my duties is to work the ice cream machine. I've been here uh, 10 years. The machine was here when I got here. The machine's actually been here since 1992. Been here a little over 15 years. One of the biggest items is we put snow in the machine. And it is a sorbet type of flavored ice. It is given to patients that have nothing by mouth. And I can tell you, it is a big treat for these patients that have had nothing to eat or drink for several days. It's like gold to them. The only time it's been broke down in the 10 years I've been here was when we cracked the faceplate, put it together, and we called and had a new one in two days. And, and in the last 10 years, that's, that's the only time it's actually not been operational. It's, it's very easy to use. Probably takes four minutes to clean it and put it together. It's the only ice cream machine we have in the hospital, so anyone coming through the line that wants an ice cream or yogurt uses that machine. It's all self-service, so they come up, they get their cup, they get their ice cream. You'll have a nurse that, you know, they see bad things too, and you know, it's the happy place too. We, we, we're a healing hospital, so we have good things, but we have bad things too, and they'll come in and they'll even still have their surgery hats on, and they're dressed in their greens and their scrubs, and. Oh, they'll just be so worn out and they'll grab them an ice cream and they pop down and then you, they're, they're almost humid again. The only improvement that I would see is I think that it needs a little bit more fanfare. I think it needs to be not so hidden back here and some ice cream cones would be very nice. And I think that would be great. Might be pushing it with the sprinkles but that wouldn't be a bad idea. My name is Abe Padura, crew manager to uh, White Castle in Dearborn, and I've worked here about 23 and a half years. This particular machine we had the first day of our grand opening, which was July 30th of 07. My name is Bob Harrison. I uh, am a regional director of restaurant operations for the Detroit region. I've been with White Castle for just over 40 years. We uh, serve chocolate shake, so we mainly use it just for serving chocolate shake. A few years ago, we decided that in the Detroit region that we wanted to serve frozen Coke and frozen cherry beverages. So unfortunately, at that time, a decision was made to remove shake from the menu. The machine we had before, the temperature on it didn't stay at a consistent level. There were some times when the product came out too watery, sometimes they came out too thick. We made a decision that we wanted to reintroduce shake to the Detroit region for White Castle. So then we set down some criteria. Uh, first criteria was that we needed a piece of equipment that was high quality. Second criteria was that it had to be something that was easy for our people to maintain. As few moving parts as possible, easy to sanitize, easy to replenish the product in there, and then also as small a footprint as possible. And viewing the different opportunities with the different suppliers that was available, we decided that SantaServe actually offered the best counter model out there for our purpose. I was excited about the idea of getting chocolate shake back in because I knew how much our customers missed it. Uh, we've got customers that are coming back day after day and they're buying our chocolate shake products. It stays at a consistent temperature. You don't have to you know, tell a customer that our shake machine is not at the right level right now and they wouldn't be able to get what they want. There's uh, less headaches. It's easy to maintain. There hasn't been any problems with it as far as breakdowns or needing to constantly reset the temperatures on it. You know, some, sometimes you have to go to new companies to find innovation, but uh, not always. You know, sometimes you can find innovation, which we believe that's what we've found in the machine that we've selected, but also we've got the insurance and assurance of a company that's been around for a long time that we know we can count on. White Castle's been around for 86 years, Sandy served 75 years, we'll both be here.